Key. Well, get ready to see another way of trash removal in Muskogee County. You will now see blue garbage trucks rolling in your neighborhood. It's a new initiative that will save Columbus taxpayers money in the long run. News Letter 9's Catrice Nolan joins us live from Midtown with more on uh, what you can expect. And Catrice, we may see this change, we understand, as soon as next week. That's right, Barbara and Jason. The city is pretty much saying out with the old, in with the new, and throwing away its old system just like yesterday's trash. And everything and those new trucks start rolling out as soon as Monday. John Pittman is checking out his new fleet of automated trucks at the city's public works department. He's making sure the trucks are ready to roll by Monday, giving Columbus a more efficient way to collect and haul your trash. This new system is a more efficient system, more uh, user friendly. The Fountain City used to haul trash like this. A three man operation where maintenance workers would haul trash, but these 40 new trucks can now operate with one person. That's about 30 people that we're going to eliminate. Nobody will be losing their jobs or anything. Uh, we're just going to reassign them to certain areas. Mayor Skip Henderson says the new system came down to saving the city millions of dollars over the next few years. One, it is going to ultimately save some money uh, in the long run, but the other thing it does, it frees up uh, the inmate labor for doing some things that we desperately need to, to get better at. Another way to help with staffing shortages in other departments within the city. And the mayor says just in case you have some extra trash that you need to haul, just dial 311. 311 is the magic number. We're not going to leave them hanging, uh, at least through this year. Uh, we will continue to pick up any extra garbages out there. And Money to pay for the $16 million fleet is from the American Rescue Plan or ARP funds, an automated rolling investment. And, and we've got Keep Columbus Beautiful that does a great job. Uh, we, the city council has actually increased the amount of fines for people who are littering. Now we're trying to keep the city as clean as possible. Now, if you live in Columbus or Muskogee County, there are three separate ways that your trash is hauled. You either have a black can, a blue can, and a green can, and they want to make sure that all of that trash is hauled away properly. So they're asking that you can leave your cans at least three feet apart so that the automated trash truck can pick it up the right way. So we hope that you do your part. Reporting in Columbus, Catrice Nolan, WTVM News Leader 9. We were talking about this earlier. I forgot that we have those three cans yes. for recyclables, trash, and for your lawn stuff. So. I know them all very well. I'm a firm believer in trash going out. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Thank you, Catrice.